Hello, welcome to Shad Life. I am getting my ride on. I brought my titanium Esker Hay Duke. The reason for that is I'm going to ride this trail. I haven't ridden it in a very long time. I'm going to say it well over 10 years, believe it or not. Um, this trail called Terrace Oaks in Burnsville, Minnesota is one of the Minnesota off-road cyclist trails. Um, and it is one of the earlier trails I ever started riding regularly. I actually used to live out here in Burnsville and I'd come hit this trail in the early 2000s. So probably right around 2002, 2003, somewhere in there, I was riding this trail. Um, and it's had a few updates since then, but it is pretty much unchanged aside from some of the fixes that have been put in um, to mitigate uh you know erosion and water flow and stuff it's pretty much the same I, since i haven't been on it for a while i guess <laughs> talk about it when i'm out there on the trail and see what it's like so this is going to be a more of a beginner intermediate trail i don't believe it has really any features on it it didn't before or jumps or anything maybe there are things but um pretty basic trail the reason i'm riding this one is it just opened up a few hours ago <laughs> and not all the trails in our area are open and as i've been saying i'm going to be doing a lot more trail reviews so if you live here in the twin cities metro uh might be worth checking this one out especially if you're more of a beginner slash intermediate rider as you can see this is the bike trail entrance <laughs> So this is going to be very single tracky and it's actually not a very long trail. So it's good for people who are newer to mountain biking or for people who want to just do laps. But it's about two and a half miles long. It's not very long. So we'll get into it. So this uh, trail I'm on now, it was a new entrance when I last rode this trail. And the original entrance just basically came <laughs> right up that open area and then entered here. So it's kind of nice to be able to jump on single track right away. We'll climb here, take the root line and the rock line a few challenges not anything real big but fun my car said it was 74 degrees how you can hear frogs wild oh yeah there's a pond right there that's cool <laughs> Hopefully you can hear those pretty loud. I forget how fun my titanium Hey Duke is to ride. It's been a while since I've ridden it. Sometimes this is what mountain biking is all about. It's getting into the nature and Trails slightly technical as far as like XC goes. Not super challenging, but you know, enough for somebody to kind of learn that skill going over roots and little punchy climbs and stuff like that. A little descending here. Take a option over the root.
Yeah, I can tell you right now that what I like about hardtails is they have such a direct poppy feel to them. Like your power just propels you forward. It's like a solid feel. I guess I don't know how to describe it, but you don't get that with a full suspension bike. Little descending flow here. Here's a little steep, punchy climb. Good intermediate challenge. Yeah, this trail has some character to it. I really like it. Oh, my Esker Hey Duke in titanium. Uh, this bike is a blast. Right now, I have the 27.5 uh, by 2.6 tires with carbon rims on it. Um, these have the DT Swiss 350 hubs, uh, bladed spokes, alloy nipples, all to save as much weight as possible. Um, got the Sapphire. Uh, D1 fork on here from DVO, pretty sweet. Um, some race face Atlas bars. Um, I think this is still the stock stem off the original bike and I don't know if it's really branded or not. Um, but nice stem anyway. Tie frame, uh, got a PNW dropper on there and XT crank, XT rear derailleur, Dior cassette. I will probably put an XT cassette on here at some point just to shave a little bit of weight. Um, <clears throat> yeah, uh, just some Shimano single piston brakes with some uh, organic pads on them. Um, nice brakes uh, for this build. They're not XT, I don't even know what model they are they look a lot like the xt lever um but they've been they came stock on my original hey duke when i got a it in steel <laughs> super nice bike and of course my favorite saddle ergon sm pro and tie um and pilgrims sam pilgrim if you watch his channel or you probably watch all of his videos. If you don't watch his channel, watch his channel, Sam Pilgrim. But he actually has his own grips and they're actually really nice. I like these grips a lot. Um, and I got the red to kind of match my blue and red theme going on. But yeah, Esker Heydu tie. Um, I'll talk more about this bike in another video because um, I'm kind of getting rid of a bunch of my bikes and this one's going to stick around. So there you have it. <clears throat> and there's this stretch which is just a little stretch of kind of double track on here <clears throat> and then well we're getting through the trail in a moment up here so here's a little offshoot uh there's the double track, but you want to go left here. <clears throat> um, this is going to be the more challenging part of the trail. So if you're a true beginner, you want to stay straight on the double track. Oh, what's this climb? 
<laughs> oh no way i gotta go back and do that again <sighs> i did not expect that pretty steep punchy climb i guess that's why they call this the more challenging section let's try again all right let's see if i can get it starting from a complete stop down here at the bottom uh, get up a little bit of speed before i get into the climb Yeah, drop my saddle. Go right. Oh, there we go. Whoo. Yeah. Drop my saddle. Oh, there we go. Whoo. Yeah. Now going down. Caution. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, steps. Oh, I'll take these. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little ride around to the left, but steps are kind of fun. And it looks like the trail is so the trail just finishes out here on the double track, heading you back to the lot. <laughs> oh, pretty steep climb. Now I see the parking lot. Super short, but it's definitely something to do multiple laps on and it's enjoyable enough It'd be worth it. So there you have it. Terrace Oaks in Burnsville, Minnesota. Just a fun little 2.2 mile trail. Uh, something that I can lap over and over again to get my fitness on. It's got enough, you know, hard climbs and descents, kind of, you know, punchy climbs, not big, long, sustained climbs, and challenges that where if I lap it, at least it'll help me get my fitness on. And it's actually a pretty fun trail. It's really short. It's that traditional single track that sometimes is just super fun. There's no jumps or drops or anything like that, which is, you know, if I follow my channel, you know I love that stuff as a BMX rider. But no, it is fun sometimes to just get into a trail like this and just grind out some single track. So I'm going to go hit a few more laps here um, on my SRK Duke. Just loving how this bike rides. Loving it, loving it. Um, appreciate your support for my channel. Please like and subscribe. Peace. Yeah, subscribe right down there. Red button.